you. Today we're back in Target and we're gonna take a look at baby stuff. Um, somebody had a request to go through and look at um, baby stuff. So <laughs> that's why we're here today. All right, um, now we have several aisles of things and of course you have things like uh, strollers over here and um, cribs over there and things like that. But this kind of caught my eye. I was looking over here at these cute little things. Like, look at these. <laughs> I used to love buying little stuff like this. Um, the little the little socks. Like little booties. Those are adorable. I think the little, little whatever that is. Like a little animal of some sort. A pig or something. I don't know. And then they have these little headbands. Oh my gosh, that is too cute. Look at these. These are from Cloud Island. And it's a three pack of head wraps. And they have this stretchable, soft, uh, combed cotton there. And the little bows. Oh, they have different kinds too. I think they have gold and silver and pink. Oh, these are too cute. Look at that. I love these. So they're so cute. And so you get three in the pack and it's $5.99. And the little hats. Oh my goodness. Oh, the little hats. Those are so cute. They don't last long. I mean, they can't, well, for my kids, they actually, they couldn't wear them long at all. Either one of my boys, because they had such a big head circumference. <laughs> They were in the 100th percentile for head cir circumference, <laughs> so they outgrew those very quickly. <laughs> oh, have, ooh, they have a velvet one. I love the velvet bow. That's cool. So it looks like they have a lot of different colors for the little, the little bows. Actually, I think that one goes over there. I don't know. I think that one has a little pom-pom on it. <laughs> And then you have the little body suits. And if you have a baby, you will go through lots of these. They outgrow them pretty quickly. This is the six month size. Yeah, they, they really don't wear them long. Um, I would recommend, and I, I did this because I was constantly broke, but um, when it comes to stuff like this, you know, it's cute to get them for baby showers and stuff. And it's always a good thing to ask for, but Another option is to go to a consignment shop that has, you know, kids clothes, baby clothes and stuff because they're going to outgrow this stuff so incredibly fast that they're never they're not going to get worn out and you can buy stuff so much cheaper at a consignment shop and you could save a lot of money that way on stuff like like that. Oh, look at these little tiny socks. What size are they? 3 to 12 months. I like the little yellow polka dotted ones. Those are cool. But yeah, I bought a lot of clothes at consignment shops for my kids. Oh, look at these. <laughs> that is too precious. They have claws. They're lined with this nice uh, fluffy Sherpa stuff. They have these little cute like little ballet slippers too. That is, oh my gosh, my kids would have so had a pair of those if I'd seen something like that. Over here we have little outfits. This is cute. It comes with a little hoodie and then a long sleeved uh, shirt with little gold polka dots and a tiny pink bow. And this is um this is a onesie and then you also get oh the little pants. They're so soft and they have little deer on them. Little baby deer. It's kind of hard to see them, but yeah, look a little baby deer. They're very soft. Oh, look how tiny this is. This is a newborn size. Both of my kids were so big when they were born, they couldn't wear really any of the newborn size stuff. It was all too little from the time they were born. <laughs> so all the newborn stuff I had, they never got to wear it. Um, I ended up donating it to a charity because um, it's still, it's like stuff I got for uh, baby showers and it was, still had the tags on it and um, I ended up donating that. So hopefully there's a, a baby out there somewhere that got to enjoy it. Look at these little shoes here. We have Minnie Mouse on here. Oh, I want a pair of these. They're very soft. What size are they? Two to three T. And the underside, you can't really see it, 
but it has little rubber dots, these black dots on here, and they're little grippy dots. Helps them have a better grip on the floor. Oh, this is so thick. This is one of those little things to keep them warm if you're going out in cold weather. It's very thick. It has little kitty cat feet. <laughs> little pink cats all over it. And it has a hood too. A little hood back there. Oh, this is cool. I like that. It's black with white polka dots and a, a little swan is embroidered on there. Now this is a three pack. Ooh, I like the silver polka dots too. You get three of these, and this is a six month side, size for $8.99. And you can get the little pants too to go, like to put on over that. You get two pairs of the pants for $8.99. Oh, the bibs. Oh my God, you will go through so many bibs. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I actually still have a few of the bibs that my kids used. This is cute. I love cupcakes. And here's one with little castles on it. Like Cinderella's carriage there. And Daddy's girl. That's embroidered on there too. Yeah, you go through tons of those. Oh, this one's cute. Look at the little... <laughs> like a little kitty cat. Oh, and then we have some really adorable pajamas. Yeti for bed. Oh, these are so precious. This one has little animals all over the pants. Mommy's wake up call. Boy, isn't that the truth. Oh, here's a tiny pair of flannel pajamas. Oh, and a little sheep on there. This is an 18 month size. Looks like they have 2T and 3T as well and 12 months. They have different styles too. Here's some little pandas on them. We even have Christmas pajamas. Santa is my bestie. It's cute. It's little, little pants. Oh, they have a Minnie Mouse hooded robe. My kids, I, I bought a robe or two for my kids. They never really cared for them. They never really wanted to wear them. Here we have some Harry Potter stuff. This is just a like it's just a little t-shirt that's $7.99 like that oh and this one <laughs> this little outfit so you get the t-shirt and it comes with this adorable little skirt oh my goodness look at that little skirt that is so cute how much is that that's $22.99 for the for the outfit I like it I spotted this just a second ago. I want to come look at this. This is a cool sweater. I know it's for older kids, but it's actually, I just wondered if they had one in my son's size. <laughs> I wanted to see how big they are. That's a pretty, um, they have 810. They can't wear an 810, that's too small. Um, 12, 14, he might be able to wear that. That's just a cool sweater. I really like, I like the colors. I mean, I would wear that if they had one of my size. Um, let's see. Over here we have hair accessories. Now that I'm back to what I was doing. Now here's something I've never seen. It's chewable mom jewelry. Now I'm going to give my opinion on this. I know you didn't ask for it, but I'm going to give it anyway. Um, I don't think it's a good idea to let your kid chew on this. It's almost like a dog, and sometimes, I hate to say this, it's gonna sound terrible, but you have to think about your little children, children like pets. Just listen to me. If you let them chew on this, then they're going to try to chew on your regular jewelry as well. I discouraged that from the time my kids were really small, I'd, and I had one that liked to chew on everything, and I just tried to keep something around that he could chew on, but I never ever let him touch my jewelry. I didn't, I, I certainly wouldn't let him chew on my necklaces, but I am so not criticizing anybody that would buy that, but it's almost like giving your dog a shoe to chew on, and then if they chew on your shoes later, you don't really have a right to get mad at them because they don't know the difference between the shoe, the chewable shoe and your regular shoes. But again, I'm so not trying to get in an argument or criticize anybody. That's just my opinion. 
you know, people get really opinionated when it comes to kids and the right way to do things, but I would not buy that. Um, it's actually a cute necklace, but I wouldn't let my kids chew on it. Look at these little clips. I'm going to stop giving my opinion now. I'm going to just stop. <laughs> Those are cute little pom-poms. Oh, this has no... Well, it's got a barcode on it. Are these... Yeah, these are tights. These are little tights. Oh, I like these with a the little unicorn on them. Does it just have the one unicorn? I don't see it. I don't know. Maybe it's on there in other places, too. Oh, and then over here we have high chairs. Now mine, I bought my high chairs at consignment shops and they were like brand new. And you can get, and again, this is an item you may not use a lot. With my older son, I didn't use the high chair much at all. My younger son, for whatever reason, I seem to use it more. Um, I don't know why, but both of them I bought at consignment shops and it was a lot cheaper. Um, and they were like brand new and they work just fine but you know you do you do whatever works for you it, you know there are so many different ways to do things there is no right way now this I could have used for my younger son oh my goodness it is an auto rock and play sleeper hands-free rocking sounds and songs machine washable seat pad and it folds for storage he had to be moving constantly in order to be happy <laughs> I walked miles and miles and miles trying to get that child to sleep as long as he was moving he was okay and I had something kind of like this the little baby swing oh he loved that thing so much um, but I really like that over there too but he he loved his baby swing and it looks like this one is detachable like you could take it off and, and set it on the floor and maybe it rocks that way too. Oh, and it has vibration as well. And then it has the little mobile up here. Mine was really similar to this. I don't remember who made it. I don't know if it was Graco or Fisher Price or somebody, but it was a lot like this. And it was it was a lifesaver. Now this is interesting. Eight ways to swing in two directions. Sixteen soothing motions. Now that's interesting. It looks complicated. And here's another one. Huh. Wow, they didn't have all that when my kids were little. And all the strollers, my word, look at all the strollers. I have a lot of options. Looks like, um, that's kind of like the one I had. I had one that was. I, one thing I liked about it, it was small and you could just clip their car seat right into it but it was small enough to fit in my trunk I remember that I wanted one that I could easily put in the trunk I didn't want one of these gigantic bulky strollers so I got one that was kind of small oh and pack and plays oh boy my kids did not like pack and plays. They it was like baby jail. They got upset every time I put them in it. They never played contentedly in a in a baby jail. They just either one of them. They would get so mad as soon as I put them in it. <laughs> they would scream and holler about it. <laughs> what do we got over here? Oh, swaddlers. This is some. Um, this is a you know that's something you can use with your little baby, and you know it really helps soothe some kids it worked with my older son not my younger or my young it worked with my older son my younger son didn't like it so much it's a little adjustable baby wrap and I just had regular blankets like I just got some just blankets and learned how to swaddle them I do kind of like these with the velcro though that looks like it would be a little easier to work with See, you know, they have the different designs, the little patterns on there, different types of fabric. Oh, here's one that zips up. Yeah, I think I had a few of these too, where they're not completely swaddled like this. They're not the little mummy baby. <laughs> Their arms and legs are a little bit more free, and it just zips right up. 
here we have sheets all oh, these are cute with the little foxes on them I like that that's cute these are just crib sheets little fitted sheets for your crib these are cool and uh, muslin blankets hmm those are neat too flannel blankets I used I used flannel blankets a lot with my kids um, especially my older son who was born in winter time oh a little lovey look at that oh that is so incredibly soft see it see it's almost like a little stuffed animal attached well that's all it is basically it's like a little stuffed animal attached to a nice blanket both of my kids had a super soft blanket made of this material it had the little border on it and they both still have their their fuzzy blankets <laughs> I mean they don't use them or play with them but they they didn't want to get rid of them so we still have them here is a changing pad cover oh it's so soft I like the wide variety of um, different patterns and fabrics they have oh that's a nice quilted blanket too oh that's so soft it feels like um the cloth diapers you can get kind of like that oh this one's cute I love that mint green color I just cannot tell you how incredibly soft that is look at look how furry it is <laughs> that is so soft oh here's one's like a little knit bird this one's smaller oh, look at all the time Get all the tags on this thing, my god. <laughs> hmm. What do we got down here? Oh, a little piggy bank. A little unicorn piggy bank. That's $14.99. And then we have a little, oh, a little lamb. I got a lot of little lambs when I was born because of my name. <laughs> Here's a unicorn one, too. It's cute. Those are $14.99. Oh, I like these sheets with the feathers on them. Those are neat. Oh, these have gold dots. Look how shiny that is. That's awesome. And little birds. Here's another unicorn. And this part has little gold flecks in it. Little tiny. Up there we have mobiles. <laughs> I like that one along with the tree and the little... Acorns are cool. Oh, a little cloud mobile. <laughs> and whales with anchors. And there's some more whales. And over here we have the, um, you have your cribs over here. This one's nice. I like the sheet in there too. Yeah, and, and a lot of these are convertible. Um, where you can later you can convert it into a bed like a toddler bed yeah it's it's pretty neat so it's multi-purpose this dark one's pretty too that's nice and a white one here what we got here on the end oh a little outfit look at that cute little thing it's interesting colors on there too I don't think this is actually supposed to, oh, it goes down here. Two rompers, <laughs> zero to three months. This about $10.99 for two. I like the little pocket on the front. And then they even have wallpaper. Oh, it's like a little giraffe. Neato. Let's see if I can hang this back up. There we go. Ooh, that's bright. Look at that. Ooh, that's vibrant. A little sign that says hi. That's a cute little toy. <laughs> that's so sweet. Hello. I guess that's a cat. Not really sure. Oops. Get back up there. Looks like a lot of their stuffed animals are $14.99. Here's another crib. And then you have car seats. Boy, that's a lot of fun trying to pick out a car seat. Whew. I, I'll be honest, I do not miss the days of snapping my kids and getting them in and out of their, <laughs> in and out of the car in a car seat. 
the heavier they get, the harder it is. Plus, with my older son, I had a two I had a two door car, and it was really hard to try to climb in the back seat to get him in and out. I killed my back. Oh, look at the little pacifier clips. Here's some little mustaches on them. Oh, I like this one with the owls. These are from um, Ulu, Ulu, Bulu. Ulu, Bulu. I know that name. So it's just a little clip. You can even write your child's name on the back. Neither one of my kids like pacifiers, and I didn't, I didn't push it on them. I thought, well, that's just one less thing to break them of when they get older. And this one has little race cars on it. <laughs> You see, when I first saw them, I thought they were tiny suspenders because of the little <laughs> little clips down there. But anyway, keeps them from dropping their pacifier, which is good. You can hang on to it better that way because sometimes they do just spit it out and you don't notice. Um, so, yeah. Oh, look at this little thing. So you could put this right up next to your bed. Oh, that would have been useful. Yeah, see, you can put it right right next to your bed. Cute little thing there. And then you have the, the seats for the older kids, like the little booster seat, which here in North Carolina, they have to stay in until they're either eight or weigh 80 pounds, I think, unless they've changed it. But both of my kids are out of booster seats now, so we don't, don't have to do that anymore, but yeah, that's part of life. Oh God, look at these little pants. Those are adorable. <laughs> little tiny pants. Oh, they're on clearance too. They're 1048. They're not supposed to be there, I, but I don't know where they're supposed to go. So I'm gonna leave it there. But then we have diapers, overnight. Oh, I do not miss buying diapers, and I'll show you why. Look at this. One pack is $24.99, and you would not believe how fast you will go through a pack of these diapers. I bought a lot of my diapers at Costco. You get the giant boxes, and it is a bit cheaper that way. Oh, and look at all the pacifiers. My goodness. But yeah, I tried pacifiers with both of my kids, and they just never really seemed to care about them, so... I didn't push it. It's just one less thing to deal with later because a lot of kids have a hard time giving it up. So, And here we have the baby food. Little snack bars. And baby formula. Harvest would pass out if she walked through here. Um, bottles. Let's see. I already looked at that. What have we not looked at? Oh, and then they have little clothes for older kids. These are, well, that's a 12 month size. That's cute with the little fuzzy sleeves. They even have elf on the shelf pajamas. Look at that. Where are the boys' clothes? I never even saw it. This is all girl stuff. Oh, look at that. That's so cute little dresses. Ooh, this one's really pretty. I like that. Oh, little reindeer. That's a newborn size. Look how tiny that is. Oh, look at this little coat. Oh, this tiny coat. That is so adorable. And it has a hood on the back. And it comes with little, little tiny black pants. And a little onesie. Oh, that is such a cute outfit. Oh, and they have overalls. <laughs> That is too cute. This is a newborn size, and you can get the whole outfit for $15.99. That is so sweet. Oh, here we go. Here's the boy stuff. <laughs> I dig dessert. Those little construction things, and then just stripes on the back. It made you smile. What is this? Oh, these are scratch mittens. Yeah, I had to use these with my 
older son. He was really bad to scratch his face. So what you do when they're little, you put these on their hands because they're really bad. Even if you keep their nails trimmed, they can scratch their faces and they, they don't know that they're doing it. They, they don't do it on purpose. It's, they just, they can't help it. And then we have little tiny shoes. I'll tell you what though, when my kids were that little, like these are zero to three month sizes, I didn't really put shoes on them. It seemed like a waste of money. Now I always made sure they had on nice thick socks. You know, their feet were covered, their feet were warm, but I didn't really bother with shoes when they were that little. It was just one more thing to take off as you changed their diapers, so. But I always made sure their feet were covered up and warm. Oh, here's another pair of the little monster shoes in gray. Oh, they have some more styles down here. They have some little knit shoes. They look like bears. Now, these are cute. Oh, look at those. Now, I do like these. These are neat. What size are they? 12 months. 6 to 12 months. Oh, that's cool. Now, those I might have bought for my kids. Well, by the time they were that old, they were wearing shoes. But when, yeah, when they were newborn, little tiny, no, I didn't really bother with it. And again, to each, to each his own. As long as, as long as they're not starving to death and, and are loved, they're probably going to be just fine. No hurry to get up. Bedtime, I'm working on it. <laughs> Oh, look, it's the uh, Where the Wild Things Are monsters. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, I would have bought that for my kids in a heartbeat. You can get three of these onesies for $14.99. Oh, I love that. Love that. Oh, little flannel pajamas. Those are cute. That you can even get him a David Bowie shirt. <laughs> it's pretty righteous. It, the, the world's cutest ACDC shirt. Oh no. That's a newborn size. Oh, and it comes with pants. <laughs> that is cool. You can even get a Pink Floyd outfit to bring your baby home in. I would have done that. I totally would have done that. Oh, nice hoodie. And you can get a Pink Floyd hoodie for your kid, too. Yeah. What's this one? Um, that's the Pink Floyd outfit again. And you can get a little Star Wars uh, Christmas-themed t-shirt for $7.99. There's another Star Wars shirt there. Oh, these pajamas are cute, too. Very soft. These are made of oh, that fleece, super soft material. I love that ACDC shirt. <laughs> that is awesome. So, oh, look at this little thing. It's a cute little shirt. I love the little clothes. I love looking at these. Now, that one has sleeves that roll up a little bit. That's a 12-month size. And this is a nice, ooh, that's warm. You know that's warm. It's so thick and puffy. That's uh, $17.99, but that's, that's really nice. Lord, you can turn your kid into a nice guy. You can get him a fedora. Look at that. That's a neat shirt there. Mm -hmm. Oh, a tiny vest. Look at that little vest. That's 18 month size. That's sweet. And the snow suits. I bought these for my kids and they wore them a few times. Now here where we live, we don't get a lot of snow. So um, they don't get a lot of use out of them, but they both ha they've both had them. <coughs> here are some more little pants. <coughs> Sorry. I like these because you don't have to unbutton or unsnap anything. Um, they just have the elastic <coughs> waistband. I think one of my kids has brought me up <coughs> a bit of a bug or something. I feel fine, though. It's every now and then I get a frog in my throat. It might be allergies. 
And here's some more little shoes. Look at that. <laughs> Those are cute. And koalas. And then over here, we have some little tiny socks. You see, they have a lot of these Cat and Jack things. But they have little socks, little training pants. Oh my gosh, just too much cuteness everywhere. Even cute little hats. So that's a look around some of the baby stuff. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you again really soon.